question, which one do you think is distilled water? Would it be inside jar number one, jar number two, or jar number three? Or would it be all three? This video is about distilling distilled water in a water distiller. So what I did is I bought eight of these plastic jugs full of distilled water. It's a gallon or four liters each, so I did eight distills. And what I did is I filmed every part of it and I did a collection from the boiling pot after each distill, like once it's cooled down a bit, and then uh, you'll see what's left at the end. Basically the purpose of this video is to show that plastics do seep into the water. Even if it's distilled water, it still seeps into it. So if there's anything left at the end of the collection, then that must be from the plastic.
This is the end of the Distone Number 6. This is uh, store-bought still water, right out of the jug, we're going to put it into this one. Leave it blue, so we know as a reference. It's pretty clean. So this would be distilled number 7. This is the end of distillation number eight. We're going to check the pH level of normal tap water. So it looks like it's holding at 7.49 pH. That's with tap water. So let's check the distilled water out of the jug, 7.34. So now the next one will be the true distilled water. Yeah, it looks like it's holding at 7.11. Okay, I'm satisfied with that. This is the bar product of the eight distillations. Okay, so it looks like it's holding steady at 8.66 and I'm happy with that. And that's for the remnants of the distillation after eight distills. It's very alkaline, alkaline, but I wouldn't want to drink it, that's for sure. pH test done. Okay, so for the next test, total dissolved solids. Let's put it in there as top water. Not too bad, 151. This is the distilled water out of the jug. And we're getting a rating of six parts per million. We're gonna stick this in here, a reading of five, so. Not much cleaner, but it is one. Okay, now for the remnants of the distill. That's quite a bit higher, look at that. 741 parts per million. So that test is all done. What I'm gonna do is pour this 
into that coffee filter paper and see what's left over. So that's the remnants of the distilled water after eight distills, and we're gonna put it in here. And that's just standard coffee filter paper. There, you can see the, uh, the particles that the filter trapped. I'm assuming that would be plastic from the jug, just an assumption. It is filtered a bit, and there's what's left over.